Hey, greetings, YouTubers, and welcome back to a Toddy Walnuts overview collection video. Today, I would like to share with you guys my Toby Hooper's 1974 classic, The Texas Chainsaw Massacre collection that I have. I have quite a few editions from different countries, and I'd like to go ahead and show you guys what I have to maybe give you guys an idea of what's available out there. And there are so many different editions of this film. It's a classic. It's my favorite horror movie of all time. And I think I'll just jump right into it here with the first edition that I have, which is from Taiwan. And this is the 40th anniversary edition. And it comes with this nice slipcover. I haven't opened it yet. This is just a collector's edition here. But I wanted to kind of give you guys a little overview of what I have. And this is a Region 3 DVD. And it is in English with Chinese subtitles. And I believe this is the first and only Region 3 DVD that I own. But I knew that had to be part of the collection. I'm not exactly sure what it's limited to, but it comes with this really nice slipcover. So I added it to the collection. The next one here is a DVD from Italy. And this one is a little bit banged up. It, it's a little bit oversized, so when it was shipped, it got kind of crunched. And you can see that there's a crease down the spine. So I may try to find a better edition of this at some point, but for now, this will do. This is the Ultimate Edition 2 DVD, and as you saw, it does come with this slip box. And this is Region 2. And they took the transfer from Dark Sky, which is a U.S. company. There you can see the two different DVDs. And it does have some background art. There you can see the house in the background. Oop. Try to show you guys without that reflection. And it comes with a little booklet here. And of course it's all in Italian, but you can see some stills from the film. So that is the Italian edition of the film. And the next one here is a Blu-ray from Denmark. This one is still sealed. I believe this one is cut. It says it's rated 15. The original restored remastered. This one is going to remain sealed. I'll show you guys the copy that I watch, the copy that I recommend. That is the Danish Blu-ray edition. The next two here are from Australia and this is from a company called Umbrella. This is the DVD. It says it's the ultimate two disc collector's edition remastered in high def loaded with special features. And it does have this pretty nice swing tray. And you can see in the back it has that ground beef packaging. And you will see more of that later in this video. And the next one is the Blu-ray from Australia, also from Umbrella. <clears throat> it's the same exact features and all that stuff. This is just a collector's edition. And there's 
just the disc. There's no interior artwork or booklet or anything. This is also from Umbrella. Uh, the next two here are from Spain, and this is the 40th anniversary DVD edition. And the Blu-ray edition, which comes in this really nice digipack. This is probably my second favorite edition that is not from U.S. This is a really nice edition here. And there you can see Sally Hardesty, who was played by Marilyn Burns. Again, you have a background image of the house and the skyline there. The next one here is from Mexico. This one is still sealed. This one is from a company called Zima Entertainment. And the next two are from the UK. The first one here is the DVD. And this is from a company called Blue Dolphin. Okay, you can see the disc. Same art that's on the cover. And here is the Blu-ray. This is called the Seriously Ultimate Edition, which there are better editions than this. And this is from Second Sight Films in the UK. This is a very good edition, but it's not the best edition, in my opinion. This one is uncut, however. Second Sight do a very good job with their films. And it does have a ton of special features, but again, that's not the most that you can get for your money. The next two editions here are from France, and the first one is the DVD. And this is from Studio Canal. And this edition is really cool. This is the box set from France, and this is the Blu-ray DVD combo. This is limited to 3,000 pieces, and I have number 2,280. And it comes in this really nice slip box, and it looks like the chainsaw has ripped through the top of the box. It's a plastic shell box here. And this is a, from a company called TFI Video. And this is very similar to the U.S. edition that was put out by um, Dark Sky on Blu-ray uh, in the Black Maria box set, which you'll be seeing shortly in this video. But this is the four-disc edition. This is a really, really good edition. I love that. That's awesome. This one's a little bit harder to find, but if you search on eBay, you can find it. And it comes with an apron, 
a bloody apron. And it comes with some art cards, which I'm not going to open. And it comes with a poster, which just looks like the original 1974 theatrical poster. Very nice touch to the box set. And then it comes with this thick book here. which it's all in French, but you do get some nice stills from the film. And I'm going to pause it for a second, just kind of give you guys a look at the bottom of the shell here. And I'm gonna pause it, put this stuff back, and we will continue. Now I have some German editions I'd like to share with you guys. And the first one is the four disc DVD Blu-ray edition from Germany and this one comes with a ton of special features comes in this nice it's not as sturdy as the French edition but it's still a nice sturdy box and it comes with a book and again this is all in German nice thick book There's some scripts, there's some write-ups, but unfortunately I don't read German. But this is a very nice collector's piece. And then it comes with the Digipack. And this is the German four disc set. It has one Blu-ray and then three DVDs. Does have some nice background art there. See Bubba Sawyer. And then on the back of the Digipack here you have a panoramic view of Leatherface chasing Sally Hardesty down the country driveway from the home. The next one here is a German lenticular DVD. You can see Leatherface kind of slashing his chainsaw. It's a really nice, I'm not sure if it's picking up on camera here, but it's a really nice lenticular cover. This is put up by a company called Turbine in Germany. And I have some hard boxes here. The first one is a small DVD hard box, and this is called the Skin Mask Edition. And this is in a plastic sleeve, but it has the texture of a kind of a fleshy mask. I did show this one before in a different video. This is from XT Video. And I have a big DVD hard box, and this is the uncut two disc limited edition, also from XT Video. This one was limited to 666 pieces. I have 153. And just to show you guys a size difference between a small hard box and a big hard box, it's about maybe an inch. And then the thickness, it's a little bit thicker. And then finally, my favorite hard box is also a limited two-disc edition. And this one is very, very limited, hard to find. I got to get plastic to put this in. This one is opened. This is from Turbine. And this is limited to 131 pieces. I have 41. And this is a two-disc edition here. So now I will get into my US releases and we'll cut the video short here. Um, let's see, the first one I'll show is the DVD from Pioneer and this is just basically a regular Amore case 
This is a special edition DVD. Pioneer Video put this out. This is the standard edition DVD. And then they also put out what they call a meat pack. And on the back of this one, it looks like a pound of ground meat. And basically it's just a better edition of the first bare bones. Not really bare bones because it does have a lot of special features. But it doesn't have that, I guess, that picture of the ground meat on the back, which is pretty cool. And it it is um, embossed, so it does feel like it's actually a pound of ground meat. And then I have a DVD steel book from Dark Sky, which I think looks really nice. Two-disc Ultimate Edition, they're calling this. And it has a ton of special features. Dark Sky really nailed it on this one. And then my favorite edition to watch is the 40th anniversary Blu-ray from Dark Sky. And this one is very affordable. It's about probably $20 or less now. It comes with this slip cover to make it look like Leatherface is coming through the door. Or you can put it through this side to make it look like the door is closed. And it comes with this. It does have some nice background art to look like the door, the uh, area where Leatherface was butchering the people in the back, the hogs and the people. <clears throat> and then this is when he came out and committed his first murder with that hammer. And there was his first victim right there. And there is a blood-soaked Sally Hardesty. Iconic image. And this edition looks absolutely beautiful. It's 4K and it is 4 disc. And see if I can get these out. It's got that the new fangled push. I'm not going to pull those all out. But it does have background art of the house with the skyline again. And then there's the reverse of the Digipack. And I absolutely love this edition. I recommend it. Couldn't recommend it more. And this is the ultimate edition that Dark Sky put out. And this is called the Black Maria box set. This is the special edition limited. I'm not exactly sure what it was limited to. But it is the 4K restoration, 4 disc, DVD, Blu-ray combo. It has over four hours of commentaries, interviews, outtakes. Comes with the mini poster, the apron, same as the French edition. It has an exclusive bonus fifth disc. And it has an interview with William Friedkin and Toby Hooper uh, called A Conversation About the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. And this is a really nice edition. I'm going to keep it sealed just for collector's purposes, but... This is a really nice edition, but if you're going to get an edition just to view, this one here is my recommendation. The Dark Sky 40th Anniversary Collector's Edition 4-disc set. You can get this for, like I said, around $20. And when this one came out in the summer of 2014, it was the list price was um, $99.95, I think, or something like that. But you can get this one brand new for probably $50 to $60. Bucks. So if the collector in you want something special from the TCM, I would probably go for this one for the $50 mark. And I'm sure there have been hundreds of unboxings of this on YouTube. Just search it out, but mine's going to remain sealed. So I'm going to do, I'm going to pause this. I'm going to show you guys an overview and then I'm going to cut the video. Before I do an overview, I just wanted to mention one thing about the Dark Sky 40th Anniversary Collector's Edition. It is DVD sized, so if that bothers you, just to kind of show you a comparison between a standard Blu-ray and the 40th Anniversary Collector, Collector's Edition, it's about, again, maybe an inch taller. So I know that might drive some people nuts as far as uh, displaying on shelves and stuff like that, but it doesn't bother me. I just wanted to point that out. So here's the overview. Here are the first 12 
in no particular order. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Leave any feedback in a comment down below. Let me know which additions you guys have and let me know which ones I should pick up. And I'm going to show you guys the next pile here. Here are the next eight. Again, these are in no particular order. Just a little overview video. Hope I gave you guys some ideas of something to pick up. And I will show you the two box sets. Here is the French box set one more time. And here is the U.S. Dark Sky Edition. So thank you guys for watching. Take care. Hope you all are well. And I will catch you in the next video. Later.